New worries about climate change and the threats to the world's oceans. It's called ocean acidification, and it means the carbon dioxide released by humans. It's not just making the planet's atmosphere warmer. It's also changing the chemistry of the oceans, making them more corrosive. RNN's Carolyn Rowe has more in tonight's Eye on the Environment report. Most people know that humans emitting greenhouse gases are making the planet warmer. But every time you start your car or turn on the lights, 30% of the carbon dioxide you emit is absorbed by the oceans, making them more acidic. And that's bad news for all kinds of sea creatures with hard shells or skeletons. This experiment shows the effect that more acidic seawater will have on tiny petropods by the year 2100. Pteropods are important for a lot of species in the ocean. So it could be fish, it could be seals or whales that eat the fish. And new research shows conditions for coral reef could soon reach a tipping point. The concentration of CO2 in the atmosphere is rising. Corals are stable here at 350 parts per million. But CO2 levels are already at 385 and rising quickly. At 450 and higher? We can pretty much say goodbye to coral reefs. Not only does a third of ocean life depend on coral reefs to live, if corals go extinct, so will research into potentially cutting-edge medicines and other unknown benefits. They contain species that hold enormous medical secrets. We are maybe losing species that hold enormous promise for relieving human suffering and preventing human death. For News Center Now, Long Island, I'm Carolyn Rowe.